Hey YouTube, it's Fix It With Biscuit here, and uh, what we're going to do is I want to build a shop press. Sure, I bought it from the um, scrapyard. I bought uh, four of them, and I also have what we're going to use is most likely I'm going to use is this is a big uh, hydraulic power pack unit that I bought uh, a while back. I got a uh, hydraulic rams down here not sure which ones I'm going to use I have these red ones and then I have some black ones that are buried down there that I think are actually more heavy duty than the red ones I think I'm just going to put one ram on it for now this isn't going to be a gigantic you know press uh, it'll probably only be I I don't know you know 10 to I'm hoping 10 to 15 ton I'm not sure. That's something I'll have to figure out the math after I get it uh, all set up. But I can build the frame and uh, pretty much make it all together and then decide if I want to do two rams or what. And I can always change the rams later. So uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and cut these. back after we cut the other one so I got the ends cut off all the way I cut, uh, these are the ends that uh, were cut off so I managed to I'm gonna go ahead and notch these probably wasn't in the shot at all. Well, anyways, what I did was uh, I set this up here and notched it here. So this is where we'll have to cut it out. Okay, now we're going to cut these out. Alrighty, I'll set it up and weld it together.
Well, I'm going to continue welding this up. And uh, when I'm done, I'll show you. I'm going to be here a while. We're going to... Um, i got to stop saying that. That is getting to be an annoyance to me myself. Going, um, 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 uh. I need to just think about what I'm going to say and just say it. So, we're going to drill a two and a half inch hole for the ram because I want it to offset up this way and then it'll hold it from side to side motion some. And the fact that I forgot that I... I didn't in count in when I measured it for uh, tools, uh, dies and stuff like that. So therefore, it's going to be the wrong uh, depth. And I want probably, you know, seven to eight inches of workable area. And I measured it out to be seven or it measures out to be eight inches right now uh, from ram to platform and then when I put my dies in that'll eat up you know a couple inches on each side probably three to four so you know now I'm down to four inches of workspace and that's just not gonna work so that's why I'm going to drill this out and then I'm going to I keep sneaking that out. Um, in there. I am going to brace this a lot more. This and the platform. I'm probably going to do some uh, angle braces on both sides. So uh, let's get to cutting before I say um and uh and all that crap again. Alright, what we're going to do is we're going to make some bracing that goes from the top to the sides to give it a lot more strength and we're going to use the chop saw. This actually isn't even a metal chop saw. <laughs> this is actually a wood chop saw that I uh, just put a metal blade in. The guy was throwing it away and said it was no good. Well, as you see, it seems to be working just fine. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna take these and put them in the corners here like that so it uh, gives it a lot more strength and that should give it a lot more so we're gonna go ahead and cut another one and we're gonna put a couple underneath there too so I'm gonna go ahead and cut these and uh, we'll be back when I get ready to do something next okay what we got here is I cut the hole through so the hydraulic ram could come up. I got these uh, braces that I drilled holes in so I can just pin straight through the hydraulic ram. And I'll weld them all the way across here and down and over. And then I'll have the bracing on this side to hold it. And uh, this here should hold the hydraulic ram from going side to side. Uh, that's what I'm hoping, so I don't have to have any bracing from here. But if I do, I'll make a bracing, whatever. But I'm try trying it without doing that. Um, I got the bracing down here set. Uh, it's not, it's just sitting in there. It's not welded in there. Um, let's see. <sighs> what else do we got here? Well, that looks about it right now I'm gonna call it a day I've been at this for a while I'm uh, tired and 
we're gonna go home 